Hello everyone, today I'll be trying to get 3 wins with the Hydra Splatling. A very very powerful and slow backline, but definitely something that can be good if you really put the time into it. That E-Leader does scare me though. You are going to be countered pretty hard by chargers who have a very 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 slow charge time, but after you get fully charged you're a 3 shot kill and you can shoot for a pretty decently long time. Unfortunately we're already losing everyone right off the bat. We are a backline so our job is not to necessarily get kills. But to just make sure we're playing defense and get picks if they push too close to us. Right now, I'm going to stay on the tower here. Probably going to regret this soon enough. Yep, E-Leader's right there. I'm going to try and just stay alive. Hold on. I'm going to stay on here as long as I possibly can. Okay, I've got Booyah Bomb now. Sorry, I'm not talking about the cat. I'm trying to focus on making sure I'm doing the right thing. Okay, careful. Just recover. Stay alive. They're boo or. <laughs> Their E-Leader is dead. I'm getting a little too engrossed in the match here. You got Auto Bombs and Booyah Bomb. Booyah Bomb is good for sniping off our foes or just displacing the enemy backline. Auto Bombs are good for poking if you really don't want to go for that charge time. And lots and lots of run speed is recommended here. Stay alive. I'm probably going to die here. Yeah, didn't really need to fight the S-Blast at that point. Should have either backed off or gotten a better position to fight. I'm just a little too wary of the E-Leader. Best thing I can recommend is since a full charge is the only way you'll get a three shot kill, you can't do it if you're just partial charging. Try and stick behind cover until it's time to actually go in for the full kill. But if you do feel comfortable enough with your aim, you can do a partial charge. Just make sure you've got your aim on point before you do anything rash. Hold on, stay alive. I'm gonna try and booyah bomb here, just so I stay alive. I'm gonna jump out now. If I stay alive, that's good. I don't really need to be that close to the objective anyways because I am the back line of the team. Our teammates are doing a pretty good job of keeping them off of us. I'm just going to go for a full charge here. I don't think that's going to kill me, but I'm going to back up just in case. Go on, try and get there later. Ah, the blaster got me though. I've got three one-shot weapons actually. I thought they only had two, but they have the stamper too if it's close enough. I'm not doing great on defense here, and that's partly my fault because I'm just very scared of the sea leader. I'm going to try and get behind this and charge. Come on, move quick. I'm very surprised absolutely no one died there. They were trading hits for each other. That's annoying. We're going to stay here. Thankfully, we stopped them, though. Stay alive. The sea leader is actually missing quite a few shots, so we might be able to play a little more risky here. I'm just going to stay behind cover here. Make sure no one can reach me and stay alive as much as possible. I'm going to get some paint down. Definitely want to charge Booyah Bomb as much as I can. I'm going to recover some ink here. Until they take that E-Leader out, I don't want to poke out because I don't really have targets to shoot for. And I'll just end up getting myself killed. Ah, oh, that was the blaster. Really hard to tell whether or not that's the blaster or not. I'm not keeping track of them. It's very annoying that I'm just getting one shot too. Move back in here. Hold on, stay alive. The E-Leader is actually down there. I'm going to probably die to it. Yeah, I shouldn't have jumped off. That just makes me too predictable. Should have actually just retreated back into my ink and tried to think of something else. E-Leader outranges you, out damages you, and it charges faster than you. It's not a great matchup whatsoever. In fact, it's a pretty bad matchup, so that's why you don't want to be there. Ah, that killed too. Unfortunate, just blaster being a blaster and being annoying in tower control. <laughs> That's why it's so good in the mode. Can poke behind those corners. I really try need to try and be the cornerstone of the team. Ah, oh, that bump killed? I'm very surprised that killed me from that range. Especially because I thought I was up on a ledge, but I'm just kind of throwing here. Not doing my job. Hold on. I'm going to try and move in here. s -plus doesn't know I'm here. We're just going to wipe this out. Be very patient. Hold on. That E-Leader is there. He's probably going to throw that at the wall. I don't like that they drew that to the wall. Okay, we're fine though. It wasn't shooting at me and I can just kind of play anchor here. Okay, we're going to move back in. Hopefully, I don't die here. Yeah, Blaster's just going to poke up on ledge. Shouldn't have done that. I'm just going to jump back out. Again, no real point. We just really need to stop them at the choke point here since there's so little time left anyways. 
Okay, I can actually shred this. Good. I've got a climb tower here, so I'm just going to keep some suppressive fire on it. Not a great first match, if I'll be honest here. I'm just distracting the E-leader there. Good job. I didn't do too great there, but we did get the win, so I'll be happy with that. All right, match number two. Now, we are fighting a Hydra as a rival, and that's the only backline on our team, thankfully. So I don't really have to worry about being challenged with range here. So I can actually be a little more aggressive, so long as I don't get a little too greedy. We're just going to stay behind here. Again, charge our cover. Got their Hydra right there. I'm just trying to make sure no one's getting past that little pillow there. That's a lot of damage, actually. Hold on, back up. They're probably going to take tower here. That's fine, though. I think we'll be good. Okay, maybe not. Let's get away from strikes here. And the slosher kills me. That was sad. Uh, I took damage from the slosher. Not dying to it, but the trash strike was able to finish me off from that point in damage. Okay, they've got just one stamp. I guess he's just farming it a lot because he already threw that out. Um, didn't do great there. Shouldn't have even died to the stamp, honestly. I was just trying to think a little more. We have a Wiper with Respawn Punisher. Um, Wiper is not really a weapon to run that very often, honestly, if I am being honest. You hardly ever see that. You more or less see it running Quick Respawn more than anything else. I'm going to go ahead and try and just throw some paint down. I'm probably going to die here. So, hold on. Got full charge here. Hopefully I can get this slusher. Come on, get the kill. Ah, my aim was horrible there. He's hiding on their ledge. We didn't have any aggressive teammates up front, so I just kind of died there. Didn't have a great defense at the start, I'll be honest, but this is not my best weapon if it's not already obvious enough. I'm going to try and find someone. I believe I saw them stopping and sharking. Hold on. Try and get their Hydra. That is not their Hydra. Okay. Ah, I thought I was in my armor quick enough. I was not. That, that's unfortunate. I probably was, but I probably got shot before it actually activated. And it looked like it had activated. I'm just going to try and stay alive here. Hold on. Try and get aggressive there. Take out their back line. Good. We need to push here. Absolutely, we need to push here. Okay, I'm going to go for a charge. The pole is somewhat nice. It does tend to block your fire quite a bit, though. We're going to go ahead and throw a Vega Bomb out here. Flush these guys out. I've got a charge here. Can get this guy. That one guy missed his bomb, but there is another Hydra on the left. Or the right here, actually. He's going to have to go for his own charge, though. Oh, man. Strikes. I didn't realize they were going that way. <laughs> You're that close. Um, probably could have got the Hydra if I maybe tried to stay alive there. Though that was what actually got me killed was trying to stake my ground against the Charger. I'm going to die to the Slusher there. He jumped off the tower onto the truck. Didn't actually ex expect that. I'm just kind of making a fool of myself here because, again, I don't really know too much how to use this weapon. I just know, you know, how it's supposed to be used, but I'm not too particularly good at the actual using of it. I jumped down way too early there. We kind of, I don't know, I think our team's somewhat decent. I, it'd be probably better to have a little bit more balance, but I mean, can't really complain with what we have here. I'm just, ah, uh, my feet's constantly getting painted. I think this is showing off how the downsides to Hydra are very bad. It's very slow and unwieldy. Your charges don't last for very long if they're not full charged. So they're not gonna be very great in that situation where you're being rushed unless you have a full charge, which is why it's better to not reveal your cards before um, time to actually do things. Really need pain over here. I don't really want to move. Okay, good. I'm going to go for a full charge here and actually get some paint down. I should have Booyah Bomb and hopefully we don't waste it. We need some painting tech here to dry and just get as much paint inked out as possible. Hold on. We can actually cut off this right side here. Okay, we'll go for Booyah Bomb here. We really have to make this push last as long as possible. So I threw it down there. Tried to catch him off guard. I'm going to keep an eye on the right side here. Make sure no one's moving or approaching. Again, I'm trying to watch for flanks since we already have a back line on the tower. Hold on. Ah, trade. That's an unfortunate trade. It's fine. We'll probably lose. That's a very strong push they had at the start. And even then, after that, they added to it. I don't like that we're jumping all in there because we're going to die to bomb. Hold on. Get the kill. Good. 
Okay, we've got to make the push now. Unfortunately, that's just not going to happen. There we go. I'm going to have to rush this here. We're not stacking terror as quick as we need to if we're going to be surviving. Hold on. Yeah. Unfortunately, I can't get Booyah Bomb out in time. We were, we had to beeline tower there. If we were going to even make an attempt to push there, they weren't beelining it, beelining it quick enough. Um, Booyah Bomb was the only thing I could do there to stay alive, which is what I did. I threw it down at the tower. I just didn't, wasn't able to do it quick enough. And if we had even someone on the tower, it would have been fine. But we didn't push that tower enough. All right, next match. Again, facing a Hydra, but this is a... Uh, I mean, I would say it's a little more balanced than it is, but we do have a Brella on our team, which makes me a little worried. Brellas are either they are extremely good at the game or the canopy just doesn't work half the time. Okay, why did I do that? I need to focus on what I'm doing, though, first. Okay, I'm going to actually hang off on the left here, watch for any flanks like this guy. Just kind of poke up on their ledge there. There we go, good. There's that power being able to destroy rushes. If you do have that full charge, if you don't have it, again, it's a little bit more difficult to stop. There we go, you're dead. Gonna watch this left side here. All right, go for a full charge. Okay, Crab actually got destroyed. I was going to try and use my DPS to destroy it there, but we got, or our teammates actually destroyed it before we even got charged. The charge time is just being that slow. It is just a little bad, and that's why it's not used as often. It can still be really good, but really is special and the sub also just they're good but they're, they can be better let me say it like that back up good job again it's a good weapon but it does have some downsides that are pretty strong and make it not really be used that much in very very high level play at least you don't see it that often hold on i'm just going to go for some partials here hold on yeah i didn't realize i thought he was going to rush the tower and climb up it but he didn't that's why I was trying to go for a charge there. Would have just backed down and probably should have just backed down. But, well, we got pretty close to a knockout. If I were to try there, I probably wouldn't try much more. Just going to stay back here. He's probably going to get completely rushed. I, I'm not going to try and risk my life to just save him there. It's not really going to happen. Just trying to stop this guy. Hold on. Don't want to die to the zip caster. Okay, we're fine. Crab turned his back to me for some reason. I wouldn't really recommend that for the crab. Though I could still die to a blast shot. It actually wore off though. So that's good. I'm going to keep Booyah Bomb. I don't feel in danger of dying here yet. But whenever I do, I will try and use it. Hold on. I actually got... Ah, oh, he's flanked us. Didn't realize that. Uh, Ninja Squid being Ninja Squid there. In fact, they all three have Ninja Squid other than Lee. Splatling. Should be good though. We're doing a little bit better this match. Hopefully I don't say that and then we just completely fail. All right, that's crab. I'm not gonna fight this. I'm not dying to it. What kill? Okay, I guess the crab did kill me. Uh, probably took a little bit more damage from something else if I had to guess. Either that or I just got randomly hit by the extra bullet from it. Not gonna let the shot do this. Not really sure why he's fighting me there, but okay, that led to his demise. I'm gonna follow close behind the tower here. Gonna go for just a one ring charge. Try and do something. I don't want to be too far forward here. We, of course, want people in front of us. That's just kind of how you want to play a back line there. Unfortunately, we did get rushed there. I couldn't really do too much about that. Just do these being do these and being kind of hard to aim at at a very close range. The farther away do these are, the easier it is to catch them in a roll. Oh, that actually got the sprinkler. Honestly, don't feel too comfortable sitting here. Okay, now I do. Uh, they're actually not being very smart. I'm going to keep an eye on the flank, but... Hold on, back up. Try and get their Hydra. There we go. Good. Got an assist on it. That's pretty decent. I'm just going to go for some one ring charges here. Help out with some support fire and stuff like that. Cover this guy's roots and try and go for some fall off damage here. Okay, he's going to rush. I've got enough run speed to feel comfortable here. Well... Maybe not anymore. Again, this is a point where I probably need to jump out, but I want to try and at least support in some way, shape, or form. Staying alive is the most important thing I can do here, especially with how low we are, to actually mm, beating it. I should have just ran back. 
have a weird time noticing auto bombs. Like, I just sometimes bond them completely. Hold on. Get up here. Okay, I'm jumping out right now. Uh, okay, there might be a little bit of latency because I was in the air for that. I don't doubt that they killed me because that was a lot of fire on me and I was just still alive. But we should be fine. Again, we have pretty much a full knockout. All we've got to do is stop that there. I'm gonna try and help out, but I'm not gonna push too far forward here. Again, we have this in the bag. All I've got to do is charge a bio bomb in the last few seconds of the match, and we should be pretty good here. Just don't let the spider shot get too close. He's got ninja squid trying to go off. Again, I'm just trying to keep a charge. Oh no. Okay, well, we took the tower anyway. I'm not really sure what happened there unless the Spatana just one shot all of them. Uh, in fact, I'm very surprised there, but I would have died to the trash dot, which was unfortunate. I think we just both popped them at the same time. Either way, there is our second win, I believe. All right, match number four. Pretty scary team we're going up against. They look like they really know how to use their weapons. Um, you don't normally see an H3 unless someone really knows how to use it, so that's what kind of freaks me out a little bit. And there's also a charger, though we do, I believe, slightly, very, very, very slightly outrange the charger there. All right, take this guy out. He just poked me a little too much. I'm just making sure that charger isn't swimming straight up to me. Done. They're giving me some fodder for special, which is nice. It's actually really nice. Though I believe their charger is actually probably going for a special, too. I'm just going to hold a charge here. See if someone's getting greedy enough to actually run forward. They're not really doing that, so I'm just going to try and stay alive. Maybe throw my Booyah Bomb. I see that blaster. I'm going to try and catch him on the way up. Yep, got two, actually. Time for us to push forward. We got their charger. It's really good, actually. Get away. And let's go. Don't die to that. Good. Don't really know. Okay, I guess the charger died again. That's actually really good. Our charger isn't staying alive as long as they really need to. Okay, get me up here. Don't die. Hold on. Try and get this guy. Ah, oh, didn't kill him. Should be fine, though. Again, I'm just going to try and stay down here. You're going to get your special a lot more if you try and stick to that tower, and that's very important. I'm going to back up here. Hold on. Blaster is actually chasing. <sighs> Hitting with fall off means I'm not going to get that three shot very often. Hold on. Just try and move around here. I've got a friend on me, so hopefully he can take a kill here. He actually didn't. Jump out. Please, thank you. We really didn't make that great of a push there. Um, probably could have done a little bit more to help push that along. There we go. You should be dead. Was able to just kind of pre-fire in one spot there. Your fast DPS is very good for that. Trying to use my run speed here to actually be pretty good at evasive maneuvers. Okay, they're throwing strikes here. Trying to pick up their blaster. I'm out of ink here, but your charge is still pretty fast. Ah, oh, got comboed. Wasn't really much I could have done there because the blaster AOE is just very, very large. And as soon as I get by one or hit by one shot, that suction bomb was just too big too. All right, we're going to go for a full charge here. Hopefully catch someone trying to climb up there. Yes, I can get you. Okay, never mind. Well, Mr. Blaster is probably going to try something funny. Let's try and get some ink down. They're really trying to do special rushing here, and I'm going to make sure they can't. Not for free at the very least. Mm, lots of bombs going off. Okay, we've got to do this if we're going to stay alive. <sighs> yeah, that, that blaster is being extremely annoying poking me. Hopefully at least played some sort of distraction so he's dead now. And he is dead, but we lost two people over there. Granted, they also lost two people somehow. I'm not really sure. I guess our one guy is just being very powerful. Good job. I'm for sure going to come in here, come in that. Okay, Blaster is this way. Not going to let him do whatever he wants to do. I'm just going to try and spread some paint around. Even if they see us, that's fine. I've just got to watch my feet very good. Okay, we are just cleaning up, absolutely. I'm going to go fast here. Hold on. Should, yeah, very easily be able to take that blaster out. He had no paint around him. I'm going to stick with the tower, but not rot it. This is the charger here. I'm just going to make sure he can't move forward and try and displace him. 
In fact, this is a really good spot to displace because that bomb's just going to cover a lot of just visual or visual and just make it so that they can't really see through. We're down to 51. We've got a minute left. I'm playing the long game here and I've been playing the long game. I'm just trying to make sure we don't die. Okay, I'm jumping out now. Again, I want to be on a perch and mincemeat is a place where you can only really go back a very few amount of ways. And I don't like the ways that I can do that, so I just tend to up jumping out instead. Okay, Mr. Blaster is trying to do something funny. If I get a sweet spot, I can actually kill him with fall off pretty easily. But that's not going to happen. Ha! Ah, got killed by the um, H3. Has a good jump RNG, so I'm not too upset about it. I mean, that was pretty easily planned shot. Was just distracted by their blaster friend. But thankfully, our friends are taking care of the blaster, which isn't as much of an annoyance to me since they are just kind of dead all the time. All right, I'm going to go ahead, try and farm a Booyah Bomb. If they do rush tower or stack it here, I can actually go with a full charge and stop them that way. Hold on. Stop it. Good job, friends. I didn't even get a kill there, but probably dying to never mind not even dying to the buster there i would have if it lasted a little bit longer but we're fine no one got on the tower in time and we took the win all right there we go there's three wins with the hydra splatling not my favorite splatling but it can be good in the right hands just certainly not my hands again stack run speed you really 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 need that special charge or special power up isn't that useful here at least for me and the quick super jump is nice but it was just what came on the hat if i were to use something i would use these glasses here it gives us a little bit of earn sp or swim speed to offset the heavy weight of the weapon itself and then even more run speed just one sub more but it is something i just don't like how they look so i use the he headset instead Either way, uh, we did okay. I'm not going to complain about my performance. It wasn't great at the start. It did a little bit better in some matches, but other than that, I had nothing really outstanding. Either way, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please consider leaving a comment below and maybe even consider subscribing. Until next time, bye.